Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Milk Lover, and thank you for joining me here again, and right now, we're taking a look at, of course, the Brotherhood of Maz, and we're about to go to war with the, uh, second, second Mexican Empire. As you can tell, I've pretty much completed most of this campaign, uh, all, all of that good there, Alaska's ours, parts of former Canada. Uh, as you can tell, I've annexed the new Canaanites, or new Canaan, and uh, I have a fleet here. Uh, are they still merging? Regardless, we're, uh, if you can look up here, we have a war justification against us from the Second Second Mexican Empire, and I'm going to let them invade or attack me. Because, why not? Okay, I don't know what this, these guys are doing. Uh, hold on, before I do that... Not sure where you're at. Just get rid of you. So we get this fleet here. Let's put it in half. Please? Please? Uh, I would very much like it if you would... Oh, maybe they have to be in port. There we go. No? Okay, maybe it's a little bit bugged. Yeah, it's bugged. Anyways, um, assault craft. Okay, it's very, very, very bugged. Well, if that's going to be bugged, I'm not going to use something that's really bugged. Anyways, uh, we're getting ready to go to war. Now, obviously, these are some really old ships, but they should be pretty good regardless. Um, I've re researched pretty much everything in the game already, so I'm not really too worried about this. Uh, we're going to have to go to war with these guys, and it's not going to be that difficult. Maximilian, surprisingly, united all of Mex... Not all of Mexico, but a good chunk of Mexico, so. Um, yeah, I just got, I've got all my soldiers on the border. I could maybe increase the amount of air support around here. I'm kind of waiting to see if he'll declare war on me, since he is justifying on me. He might, he might not, not exactly sure if he will. Is that a focus? No, he's manually justifying on me. So, just in case, I'm going to justify on him just again, since this... Since my war justification goal, or war goal, expires relatively soon. So, um, other than that, we're just pretty much already... I've had, I would say, a lot of fun with this mod so far. A lot, of course, I've had a lot of fun with Old World Blues. But with this campaign, the Brotherhood of Mars was pretty fun. Pretty darn fun. Especially when you became the Brotherhood of Mars from Kaisar's Legion. And you're like, oh my goodness, I've got no, like, no land because I did not give enough... Uh, Intellectual support to Lucius. So, also, the last time I didn't finish this thing, so let's do ahead. Go ahead and do calling upon the Nomads. The White Legs have failed us, refusing to attack the Canaanites. Such insolence will not go unpunished. Another tribe in Utah, the Nomadic 80s, can be used as a tool to remove the Canaanites and later the White Legs, which already bypasses because no one else exists. Um, has loyal tribe. I want to do Graham's execution. So, uh, focus dot. No checks. There we go. The war on the Canaanites has granted a boon in the industry to our ally, and even to our to ourselves, as we to provide weapons to our tribal allies. Very nice, very nice. And then, of course, we will do Graham's execution with the new Canaanites defeated. Joshua Graham, the Malpais Legate, the Burned Man, has been brought to Kaisal. To Lucius, we to finally quench the rumors of the Burned Man. Graham must be publicly crucified. Beautiful. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Alright, how many more days until they might go to war with us? Oh, they got 50,000 manpower. They got a lot of divisions, but they're, they are on scrape in the barrel. Ah, oh, they can't go to war with us because they're out of political power for some reason. God dang it. Ah, regardless, we'll do Legionary. Legionnaire. E. Utah. Utah is not deserving of any petty tribe, ally, or not. Only the Legion can claim domination over Utah, and we will bring all the local tribes to heal, incorporated under Ka under Lucius. Under Lucius. Man, I was really hoping that they would go to war with me, but I didn't realize that they were out of political power. So we've got to wait just a little bit longer. But in the meantime, I guess I'll go ahead and talk about this uh, a little bit more about the Brotherhood of Mars. Really, when you after you defeat Kaisar's Legion in the type of civil war... It's not bad. It's really not bad. It's pretty fun, especially, I mean, we started off with Kaisar's Legion, we took out a bunch of puppets, we took out the NCR, and then we had the Civil War, where Kaisar took out the Brotherhood of Steel, he took out, uh, I think one more nation as well, but regardless, I mean, we eventually crept our way through, 
and defeated Kaisar, which basically meant we had a ton of factories, and I still have a ton of factories, and you can see, I've already almost researched everything here. Um, sure, Wasteland APCs, Great War APCs, doesn't even matter anymore. Uh, p more power armor, I've got 30 divisions here. I guess I really don't need any more power armor. I guess I can make some more Coast Guards. I did make hundreds of ships, as you did see last time. But, uh, Assault Ships? I think these are capital ships? No. Assault Craft. Yeah, they're screens. They're screens. That's good. No, don't do that. Uh, but yeah. It was pretty fun. Unfortunately, we still gotta wait. I didn't expect this to happen. But regardless, um, here are my factories. It's dogs, grenades, support equipment. Um, just a lot of stuff. Nuclear jet fighters. I've got about 20... Probably, at this point, 25,000 extra planes in reserve. Ooh, refurbished tankers. Yeah, I need to be finished with that. I finally upgraded all these ships. For example, the refurbished tankers. They're not too bad. they got, a, like, a railgun. They've got a couple uh, twin 9mm cannons. Uh, they've got all the best of the... Well, not all the best of the best, seeing as they don't have stuff changed up here. But I did things that I thought would be very fitting for what I would need. So, at this point, there's really no point for me to... Uh, Really craft too much more. If we had to do another focus, the Raiders of Baja don't really need to do that. Oh, we can go to war with them again. Uh, I forgot this. Dog City Salvage. The wealth of Dog City seems unending. Surely metal could be melted from ancient beams, and electricity could be gained from forgotten generators. Yeah, why not? Oh, oh, they might have actually just finished their focus against me. Come on. Come at me, boy. Please, please. Oh, Securetron Marks 2? Nice. Yeah, we'll do that. Oh, we can't do that. We'll get Securetron Mark 1s. Okay. Come on, please. Please make me happy. Come on. We still have, we got like five days, so it doesn't really matter. Even though I don't have a lot of divisions on each one of my fronts here. But we'll see what happens. They have to tackle waterways. I've got a ton of planes. i got a lot of divisions. i got a lot of factories and planes as well. So we'll definitely see what happens. Go ahead and go to war. Ah, yes, exploiting that Hoi 4 AI. Two divisions holding up there. Uh, oh, we're actually losing a little bit here as well. That's not quite good for us. Even though I do have a spare army I'm not even using for some reason over here, that really should be over here. Regardless, regardless. That'll be alright. We might lose a tile, but that just makes them think that they're winning. You know, maybe a tile or two. Uh, where are you guys at? Go and stack some more boys over here. And you guys are a little bit up north, but the north is doing okay. Everywhere else is kind of not doing alright. Uh, how much air support do we have? Quite a bit of air support. Not bad. Around ish between 170 to... Maybe 150 to about 200, 250. Let them attack me. Let them attack, attack me. Make them think that they're, that they're winning. Uh, I'm not sure why they started to attacking... Phoenix salvage. Phoenix has been ours for decades, yet here we are constantly finding new things to use. Cash is long forgotten by even the oldest ghouls now fuel the legion. Oh, glorious. But, for some reason, my divisions seem not to be doing very well. Then again, I'm just going to go and push in using this power armor down here. You, power armor, get down there, boys. Losses. We've taken probably a couple. Oh, this is bugged now. We can't do that. So we can't see our losses. Um, you know what? If they want to push in against me, I will go ahead and directly push against them as hard as possible. Oh, the war in the north. Oh, it looks good. At least relatively good. Armor reinforcements. Uh, I'm running out of things to research. I mean, it is 2296, so I I think I've researched almost everything. Air Doctrine. Looking pretty good. Pretty good. I'll stuff up there, stuff down here. Uh, specialized Doctrines. Oh, I need to finish this up. Not bad. Ooh, this is not good down here. Yeah, they, we are fighting robots, so obviously they're going to have a little bit more strength than all the other enemies. But that's alright. They can't stand up to my power armor. There's no way they can stand up to my power armor. Even though we can't pierce them, they can't pierce us. Yeah, we're going to take quite a few losses, but you know, at this point in the game, someone's got to teach Maximilian a lesson. I wonder, is it possible to see the wars over here? No, it is not. The Brotherhood Imperial Mexico War. The only thing we can judge its loss of manpower is through here. It looks like they have 10,000 less manpower, but they might have been just creating more and more divisions. 
So there is that. Ooh, you guys can actually probably come down here and do this. Oh yeah, the power armor's doing pretty well. Maybe too well, because they might get encircled wherever they're at. But ruining their supplies is always a great fun time. Always a great fun time to ruin their supplies. But planes. Planes, 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 planes. Uh, not a lot of damage. 7 damage. 153 damage. Not bad, not bad. Overall, I don't anticipate too much of a loss. Just enough. Anything over here on the right to finish off our focus tree? It looks like our focus tree is pretty much done. We're not going to do the Baja Raiders just because I don't see a point in doing that one. Uh, motorcycles, please come down here. Great. You guys, go ahead and kill all these robots off. Ghost guards, you can move in this way. Thank you. Gun ports. Oh, gun ports. Stick your gun hole. Stick your hole. No, stick a gun in a hole. Very nice. Simple tracks. Very good. Return rollers. Glorious. Now, obviously, we can't tell how far um, we will need to go to kill off Maximilian, but it will probably be pretty far. Specialized stuff. Really nothing else is here for us to do. So, I don't want to get encircled because it looks like you guys might have already gotten encircled. Yeah, don't do that. That's an extremely terrible idea, guys. Like, as much as I want to kill these guys off, you got to realize that uh, encirclement isn't the way to go. Especially when you're down here. Alright, go ahead and plop that off. If needed. These guys might have gotten encircled like a bunch of idiots that they are. But we might as well do this as well. Oh, power armor. And letting the, just letting the AI do this. Sometimes not a very smart decision. But there's so many waterways here. But, uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. There's only a few power armor divisions down here anyways. Go ahead and come up here. Come on. I don't know why you can't retreat, like, click somewhere else. Gotta let them retreat a little bit better. Just leave, just leave, just leave. Oh, we got we got completely encircled. Wow, I actually lost a division because the Hoi 4 AI is really great. It's really, really great. But whatever. I mean, a couple power armor divisions die because of uh, the AI. Not really my fault. Not really. Alright, how long is this going to take to build? Until August 14th, so they can hold here probably for a while. I will probably need my ships come down here to come into here. Thank you. Good. They will keep attacking us, though, so that might not be very good for us. I might lose these divisions as well, because, well... Hoi 4 AI. There's really not much else I can say except Hoi 4 AI. That's that's literally just it. And I'm, I'm kind of done with this campaign at this point. Come on. Seriously, guys, seriously. Where are you? Got that. There's so many stacks of lines just around this one area. Screw it. I'm just... Uh, I don't, I don't want to say screw it. Just because I've got to take out these guys in Texas still. Um, you guys are doing okay. Please build, build, build. Come on. August 22nd. In a few days. If they don't keep attacking me. So probably by the end of the month we'll have one here. A little port. And if there, there's a little port there that we can probably hold this forever. Oh, but they're attacking me. Oh, nope. I'm going to lose this. I'm going to lose those divisions. So they're not going to die. I'm just going to have to do that. I really, really wish I could see um, the casualties. Because I'm sure Maximilian's got a massive stockpile of stuff. But, uh... That sounds like Binky's outside my room because I kicked him out because he kept being too loud. Give me please one moment as we watch us attempt to attack and attack and attack. Alright. Binky's not coming in with us because I'm tired of him disturbing me. Alright. Yeah, just... I mean, we don't win every battle. And we'll lose a few divisions here or there, but not, nothing really big. Uh, you guys... Honestly, how far do... We, I really wish we knew how far we had to go. Because we already took Monterey. And I'm not going to deal with these waterways. Like, if they take a bunch of territory from me, I don't really care. We got more than enough territory anyways. But uh, we got enough, more than enough factories. But really, just... 
eventually they will break, they will crack, they will break, and they, we will have a great time with them. Alright. Yeah, too many waterways. Uh, you guys are failing too much for me, even though you're not really failing at all. I want you to come over here and take them out this way, please. Um, we got enough. Oh, we have so much infantry equipment that the game has uh, gone over the tab again. Hmm. Glorious. Losses. What are the losses like? Well, that's a lot less manpower than what they started with. A lot less. And that's very nice to see. Very rewarding, it feels like. Alright, you guys are doing okay. How's everyone moving around? Yeah, you're all moving around someplace, somewhere. Um, nope. No upgrades yet. Oh, I will show you that the main power armor general that lost five divisions because AI is stupid is level nine. Prefectus Matus. Dumb enough to get encircled. But strong enough to have a level 9, become level 9. Go figure. Uh, you guys are doing fun in the north. Send my power up this direction, power armor. Any other XP? I, I wish you would get another, like, scale, like maybe like commando or something, but you know, whatever. I have not encountered too much of the enemy navy. Kind of disappointing. I know that... The, what was it? Chichen Itza as well as Nueva Atzlan, they, they had probably a little bit more time to focus on Navy than other nations, but that's it. Okay, that's... We had to conquer what was Santa Ana's territory, and that was pretty much it. I lost six, five divisions, six divisions. Come on, there we go. A little bit of lag, but that is one sexy Brotherhood of Mars uh, game. Beautiful. And we even have... A third of a million more manpower to conquer the Midwest, if we c could, Canadians, the East Coast, more of Texas. But regardless, I would say overall, playing as the Brotherhood of Mars, playing as Kaisar's Legion to the Brotherhood of Mars was a lot of fun. Especially taking out these smaller nations and then getting power armor using the Brotherhood of Mars um, stats, you could say. Just a ton of fun. So, uh, would I recommend someone playing as the Brotherhood of Mars? Absolutely. If you know what you're doing... Brotherhood of Mars sounds like a lot of fun. Obviously, I spent a ton of time in this game. I spent at least 24 years. That's 2296. It's almost 2297. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this campaign. If you did, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link to uh, in my disc. Check out my Discord link below in the description. And I will see you all tomorrow as I will be starting a new campaign, playing as someone else, someone else I have never played for on this channel played as on this channel in Old World Blues and it might be located on the East Coast. Anyways, thanks for watching guys and I hope you all have a great, great day.